This is Oklahoma Zone News 9. Have you been out to the Oklahoma City Zoo? And, and say the last year, you have no doubt seen the massive construction projects there, right there at the center. Yeah, it's soon to be the home to Expedition Africa exhibit, which is a massive undertaking. And we went along for the exclusive hard hat tour of the construction site. Here's a first look at what's coming in June. Eight months left. All hands on deck to complete the zoo's most ambitious project yet. Both in terms of space and in terms of cost, this is our, our largest capital project to date. Oklahoma City Zoo President and CEO Dwight Lawson says this is the tail end of a 15-year vision. It's about 13, close to 13 acres right in the heart of the zoo. A heart in need of a transplant. It had the oldest buildings, and more recently, it was considered a dead zone with animals moving to newer habitats. This will really activate stuff, bring everybody back in here. Bringing them back with new exhibits and new quarters. So what building is this? This is a new hoofstock barn. Hoofstock oh, wow. like zebras, elands, and wildebeest, which will all share the savanna, along with the giraffe which also gets a new barn. With the bigger barns, we'll be able to have a lot more, so we'll be able to really expand our giraffe herd. There will be multiple vistas to see them and multiple places to feed them. Right now, you're standing right in the middle of the savanna and giraffe habitat. The savanna surrounded by public space, including the pachyderm building, now registered as historic. We wanted to kind of preserve some of that history, uh, so we've repurposed that building, um, and it'll be public space and also have some smaller exhibits in it. You can even walk over the moats, which will be covered by glass. Well, this has a lot of components. There's a lot of new stuff going into this. Components moving into place, 12 months in and eight to go.